السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ویلکم ٹو دا آن لائن کلاس آف میتھمیٹکس گریٹ فور دس از دا چیپٹر نمبر ون لیسن ٹین اینڈ ٹاپک از ریویئن آف دا چیپٹر ون دس از اونلی دا ریویو سو جسٹ ٹیک آؤٹ دا بک فور اے اینڈ اوپن دا پیج ٹوینٹی تھری ٹو ٹوینٹی فور وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ورک آن پیج ٹوینٹی تھری ٹو ٹوینٹی فور ناؤ از اٹ کلیئر سو جسٹ ٹیک Okay, I hope you all have opened the book. So look at over here. The first question is, write in figures. This is only the review and you have to do it by yourself completely. Um, please feel free to ask me any question in the group. So write in figures. You have to write this in figures, in numbers. The first one is 35,060. Now class, listen to me. You have to do like this, 35,000. You will write this, okay. 35,000, it means 35,000. Three zeros, three places come after 35. So 3,060, 35,060, 35,060, 60 comes in 10 place here. And no number will come in 100 place, so it will zero. Is it clear? How you will write 35,060 like this? 35,060. Is it clear? Part B, 80,308. How you will write it? 80,003. Hundred and eight. Is it clear? Eighty thousand three hundred and eight. After these, write in words. They have given you the numbers. You have to write these numbers in words here. So, question number two. Question number three. Fill in the blanks. In 67,534, the digit 7 stands for dash. How you will do this? I told you earlier, first of all, you have to put all the numbers in their respective places. For example, this is 67,534. Just write it over here. 1 stands 100,000 and this is 10,000. Is it clear? So you can say or you can see over here what this stands for. 7. In 67,000, the digit 7 stands for. What is the value of 7 over here? 7 stands for 1,000 or 7,000. Is it clear? Okay. Similarly, you can do the part B, C, and D. Now come to the next page, page 25, uh, 24. Filling the blanks, you can do this part by yourself. Arrange the numbers in increasing order. Increasing order, I told you earlier, you have to arrange the numbers from smaller to greater, like this. In question number six, arrange the numbers in decreasing order. You will arrange the numbers from greater number to smaller number. Question number seven, circle the greater number. You can do it and complete the number pattern. This is all the previous concept this is the review and you have to do it by yourself so just do it by yourself after doing this you have to do it right now with me don't close your books you have to do it right now is it clear so after doing this take out the page 25 here this one is your homework for a page 25 to 26 this is your homework filling the blanks you have to Round off these numbers in there to the nearest tens, hundred, and thousand. First one is 3016. So remember this. First of all, you have to put places of each number, one, ten, hundred, thousand. And whenever you are going to round off the numbers to the nearest ten, just look the number in the ones place. Is it clear? 
and compare it with the 5. And whenever you are going to round off numbers to the nearest 100, you have to check the number in the tens place. After it, when you are going to round off the number to the nearest 1000, you have to check the numbers in the hundreds place. Is it clear? Okay. Now the next question is the number the number of children who visited a zoo and they are uh, in these seven days of the week number of children here the days of week and here round to the nearest ten you have to round these all numbers to the nearest tens in tens whenever you are going to round off numbers to the nearest tens you have to check the numbers on ones place ones place is it clear is it clear? One's place. One's place. Okay. Now, turn the next page. Person number 11. They have given you the numbers over here. And you have to put the numbers in each block. They have given you or mentioned the letters here. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and H, I. Okay. After this, you have to take out these numbers and put it over here. Is it clear? After doing this, you have completed the chapter number one. And from tomorrow, we will start chapter number two. So, best of luck. And uh, we'll see you in the next lesson. Thank you so much. Remember me in your prayers. Allah Hafiz.